This message is brought to you by the friends and partners of Kakra Baden. Welcome to Air Power with Kakra Baden, teaching the nations with signs and wonders. Kakra is the senior pastor of the Catch the Anointing Center, Accra, Ghana. Now, today's message. Welcome. Kako continues his powerful teaching titled Labor to be Blessed under the subtitle Labor for Favor. Today, he continues with more reasons why we must labor for favor. Let's join in. Key number three. It will make God and man partial towards you. Definitely partial. We must enjoy some level of partiality. Otherwise, we will struggle too much. You know, and in everything that people say, oh, there are rules, you have to follow this, you have to follow that. There are people who are not part of those rules. It doesn't matter what it is. It doesn't matter where it is. There are people who don't follow the rules. For example, take the birth of Jesus. The rule is that to come into the world, you must have a father and a mother before you can come into the world. But Jesus, God was partial towards him. He broke the rules. He had no father. He just had a mother. Mary said, How shall this be seen? I know not a man. He said, How? It's not possible. And, 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 and the angel said, the Holy Ghost shall come upon you. In other words, God was set aside the rules of normal conception. And you, you're going to have a child. Pasha. You look at Jesus' mother, Mary. Young girl. Even when her beloved, Joseph, wanted to leave her, the Holy Ghost came and said, no, you can't leave her. Partiality. But you, when your beloved was leaving you, which Holy Ghost came and said, you can't leave her? Nobody came. <laughs> Even your grandmother came to beg, nothing happened. <laughs> the angel of the Lord appeared unto him in a dream and said, fear not, Joseph, thou son of David, to take unto thee Mary thy wife. For that which is conceived in her is of the Holy Ghost. Somebody's beloved. But the Holy Ghost has jumped into their beloved doses and is giving directions. So favor makes men and God partial towards you. And that's one thing that we need. One of the amazing miracles I've heard was a woman who told me the son was missing. I said, really? It was a turning point. Tuesday. We prayed on Tuesday. The son had been missing for about 20 years. Thursday, he heard a knock at the door. When she opened the door, the son was standing there. Then the son told his story. He went to another country. He and some friends, something happened. Then they were convicted of murder. And he was locked up. Yes, right here in Benin. Locked up in prison in Benin. So not knowing that guy was in prison for murder. According to the woman, the son told her that that Tuesday that we prayed, we prayed in the morning. In the afternoon, the prison, whatever came, and told him that we have decided to release you and deport you to your country. That same day. <laughs> Some of you have been convicted of murder. They released him that day. He came out. He traveled from Benin. He came to Ghana. He appeared that Thursday. So, it was not like the guy was even roaming around and then he came. No. He was in prison. So even if he wants to come, he can't come. And he was not in prison for stealing chocolate. He was in prison for murder. To escape from that thing. I don't know how you escape. All the other 
prisoners. They remained in the prison. Only he was released. Why? God was partial. May God be partial towards us. May God be partial towards you. Thank you for joining us. Today we learned that we must labor for favor because it makes God and man partial towards you. Tune in again tomorrow for the continuation of this message. Before we go, here's a praise report to boost your faith. Visa has been granted. Dear Kakra, I wrote to you concerning my UK visa application. I'm excited to inform you that my visa has been granted and I'll be starting my master's program in a month. Glory be to God. For your time, you can contact us, seek counseling, ask for prayer, order today's full length message, or order books through the following means. Call us or message us on WhatsApp to 233 55 70 90 10. Send an email to info at You can also make a regular call or send a text to 233 Our office hours are 10 a.m. to 1600 hours GMT. Finally, write to us, share your testimony, and how this broadcast has been a blessing to you. Have you ever experienced periods in your life when you felt tired and disillusioned about the very things that used to excite you? It could be a marriage, a job, or your relationship with God. The daily grind of life can sap energy from your soul, mind, and emotions, leaving you depleted. Anything that expends energy needs to be recharged. Recharge your life with this exciting book by Kakrabaden, Energy Drink. It will keep you fired up to face each day with faith, hope, and love. You can order this book through the following means. Place your order on Facebook by posting Order Energy Drink in the comment section or message window. This book is also available as an ebook on Amazon Kindle or Kobo.com. We also deliver worldwide.